Welcome to this video of the interior segment in which we are going to show you a case who had a history of acute onset redness, intense redness which lasted for a week or two followed by a blurring of vision and then on straight examination this is what uh, the finding which we are seeing and here if you look closely what you'll see are granular multiple granular lesions surrounding by a slight haze around them. These are typical, typical uh, nominal lesions which are seen in patients post adenoviral uh, keratoconjunctivitis. So whenever you get a keratoconjunctivitis uh, associated with adenovirus, most of them will heal but some of them will go on to develop this feature or keratitis. In order to prevent that, you will need to treat these patients with uh, topical steroids. And then the other main thing is once you start treating them on topical steroids, they tend to recur back when you stop these uh, steroids in these patients. You can see on the other side, the lesions are less and they are less dense and they seems to be faded. So these seems to be less active compared to these other ones, which seems to be more intense white and there seems to be more inflammation associated with it. So this is, is an important finding which is causing going to cause a sort of visual problem for the patient. So it is very important to assess these early and to start treatment of these patients. With adenoviral, I will try and add gancyclovir topical ointment as well in such kind of patients because that is the only drug which has been shown to be active against adenoviral uh, keratoconjunctivitis. The fundus examination was normal in this patient. So you can go on to see these lesions on diffuse illumination and then you can do a retro illumination of the iris so when the light falls on the surface of the iris you can actually see these lesions in retro illumination of the iris as well of the interior segment. So thank you very much for watching.